Didn't you hear me? I said, wait here so that my driver can take you to wherever you need to go, if not for my it's meeting. It's okay. I would, I would rather find my way. Do you want to walk? No, I'll, I'll take a taxi and... And I don't want Ati to see me coming out of your car. I think you better cease, because that will end all this running around. Uh -uh. How are things? Ah, excellent, Benson. I feel like a 23-year-old boy. Mm. <laughs> Hello. Good day, sir. Yeah. OK, I'll call you. Remember that stuff I told you about? Hey, you changed. Uh, yeah. Something got on the other one. You're eating with your mouth open again, huh? <laughs> How's the interview? It's OK. It's OK. Congrats on your new position. What? Where's your head at today? The head of marketing thing I told you earlier? Oh, right. My bad. You start right away. <laughs> nice. <laughs> now, I think the next thing we should do is get an office. Like a legit office. With... Maybe we should focus on today's meeting. And afterwards, we can afford an office. What meeting? With a potential investor. And that's a... Where's something less casual? Mark Zuckerberg wears whatever he likes. When you get to Mark Zuckerberg's level, you can do whatever you like. Vina, what do you think? Vina, hmm? are you okay? Yeah, just, just a slight headache. Oh, sorry. After the meeting, you don't want to give him the wrong impression. He doesn't like beer. Who doesn't like beer? You know this guy doesn't even like me. It's not personal. He's just an old school kind of guy. You've met this guy before? Mm -hmm. I mean, isn't it awkward that he agreed to have the meeting here? He hasn't been to this house before. He has. He's Bill's his uncle. Okay. Bill's his uncle. Mm-hmm. Don't you think? Well, he's in, well, he has money. We need someone that has money, so... Really? <laughs> that's what we need now. That's what we need for the app now, money. So anyone that has money, I don't even care if it's, if it's, if it's his father, his <laughs> younger brother, I don't even care. Just someone that has money. <laughs> Good evening, sir. Good evening. Thank you for coming, sir. Yeah. Um, you know as you're ready. Mm -hmm. yeah. This is Vina. She's in charge of marketing. Good evening, sir. Good evening. And how do you two know each other? <laughs> She's my girlfriend. Oh, no, this, this isn't nepotism. She is very good at what she does. Mm. I'm sure she is very good. What? Nothing. <laughs> it's just how you are tonight. You're like a teenager sneaking his girlfriend into his house because your parents are not around. Whatever. All I know is you and I are going to be sleeping on the same bed, under the same roof, all night long. <laughs> <laughs> you seem kind of uncomfortable around Uncle Benson earlier. <laughs> I, I wasn't uncomfortable. I was just, I was probably just too conscious of being careful. Why? Come on. It's not every time a girl gets to go to a meeting with her boyfriend. Her boyfriend's best friend. Her boyfriend's best friend's uncle. I just didn't want to make a bad first impression. You know how critically observant old men can be? Like yeah. your father. Yeah, yeah, mm. yeah. Um, is he... he... He's just a casual investor, right? Nope. He's a brother investor. What does that mean? Uncle Benson is part of the club, too. Oh. Uh... Hey. What's wrong? You 
You've been sleeping with Mr. Fala. Bills told me everything. His uncle told him. You were with Mr. Fala just some hours before our meeting with Uncle Benson yesterday, right? That's why you were so uncomfortable around him. Because he recognized you. Mr. Fala. Right? How could you play him like that? For your information, your dear friend Bills has been hitting on me. Mr. Benson told Bills about us, and Bills has told Adze. <laughs> This is funny to you, sir. Vina, it's not about what Benson Madu can say. It is about what he can prove. Nothing. I've told you to stop worrying your pretty head about all this. As a matter of fact, Benson might be doing you a great favor. You are better off than that poor Piazze. I've told you to forget about it and let a real man take care of it. <sighs> So, will you meet me at the guest house by 8 this evening? Everything I hold dear to me is going to places. We are about to be exposed and, and this is all you can think of. I'd say what happened? What happened? I defended your honor. But he asked you to do that. <laughs> you, you're just a mess. He asked you to fight for me. <laughs> relax, relax. I had to relax. Relax. Vina. Vina. I will fight a dragon for you. I love you. And I couldn't just stand there and watch someone dishonor you. I can't. It's another bad review. What are you doing here? Uh, the owner? of this establishment ordered me back to work. Just this morning. Babe. Did you even sleep at all? <laughs> of course. I just woke up early. I mean, you... Yeah, you should really be acting strange. <laughs> it's just the mood. I'll, I'll get over it. You know you can always count on me, right? You know, I kind of like this vulnerable side of you. I might just propose if you continue like this. 